On just three days into the new year, an IMPD now investigating its first homicide. A police got the call of a person down right after 9 o'clock this morning, but what they discovered was much more. Authorities found the body on the 3600 block of Schofield Avenue that's near Keystone and 38th. And that's where we find 24 Hour News 8's Elizabeth Choi this evening. Elizabeth, uh, you've learned the man's identity. That's correct, Brooke. Police, or I'm sorry, the coroner's office identified the victim as 27-year-old Rodriguez Anderson. According to police, he was shot at least one time. His body, police discovered it right behind me in the Showfield neighborhood. But they're not sure what, if any, connection he has to this neighborhood. One thing they are certain of, though, after a record-breaking year of homicides for last year, this year, not the start that police wanted to get off on. The investigation is centered around this vehicle, a silver Mustang, its back window with a gaping hole in it and the front end smashed. Police snapped photos and took notes. They want to know how and why it ended up on Schofield Avenue with Rodriguez Anderson's body inside. It appears at this point in time that the vehicle was brought to this location, um, but that the the incident possibly did not occur here. Investigators believe there was an accident at another location, although they're not sure where that would be. And then somebody drove to Showfield, where police found Anderson's body in the passenger seat, marking the first homicide of 2018. I hate to see that happen. I don't know what's happening. What could be happening? Question shared by crime fighting group 10 Point Coalition. We're trying to figure out is this going to start to be a trend or is this, this is the way the new year is going to be brought in? We hope not. But they're not just hoping. They're also calling on neighbors for help. Everyone needs to uh, come together and speak up, you know, and, and, and let everyone know what's going on in the neighborhood so that we can get here in time before something like this happened. A sentiment too late for Anderson, but hopefully not too late altogether. I pray not. I pray not that we don't have a, a record wake breaking uh, year as we had last year. Now, at this time, the suspect's still at large. Police need your help in trying to figure out who that person is. If you have any information that could help authorities in this investigation, you're asked to call Crime Stoppers. That number is area code 317-262-TIPS. Live from the near north side, Elizabeth Choi, 24-hour News 8.